there's one thing in my life that's missing It's the time that I spend alone Sailing on the cool and bright clear water Lots of those friendly people and they're sure Good morning from St. Thomas. It's another beautiful day here. Probably about 75 to 78 right now. We should get up into 90 today. We will leave in about an hour from the marina and head out of St. Thomas Harbor and head over to St. John, which we will drop the hook in Kinneal Bay and spend the night there. So, thanks for everybody for following along. Before I go and have my coffee, I just wanted to let everyone know thank you very much for following our blog and our trip. We all appreciate it. It's been a great trip so far and um, hopefully we'll get to, well, I guess we won't because the Patriots have 1 o'clock kickoff time. So we'll probably miss the Patriots game, but uh, I'm sure it's nice and cold back at home in the northeast, the west, northwest. But uh, the weather today is probably, um, it's going to hit probably 90 degrees. I still probably will not be able to go out in the sun until probably next Saturday when we leave. I did get too much color on the first day, but... Um, if you guys have any suggestions on what we can do, what we shouldn't do, what should be posted, should not be posted, or anything that you guys would like to see, please shoot me an email and um, let me know because this site is for you guys too and um, just not for us. So thanks again for the follow and we'll see you in St. John. St. Thomas, awesome. Going to the town. Okay, good morning. Uh, we're about 15 minutes from untying the lines and leaving St. Thomas. Once again, we will have an east wind going against us, so we're going to have to do some tacking. We will be leaving St. Thomas Harbor and coming out to roughly the 15 degree, 17 minute line. At this point, in this point here, which is the island here is Capella Island, but we're going to try to stay right on that uh, 15 degree, 17 minute line on both tacks. But So we're going to come out of the harbor, make one tack here, tack into the red number two, come back out once again to the 15, 17 line, and take one whole shot right into uh, St. James Bay. Over in this area here, there's a little cove called Christmas Cove, and it's a great anchorage, great snorkeling and a good place to stop at that point and just have some lunch and um, relax a little bit so then we'll keep the sails down and we'll go through the hole here and then we'll put the sails back up and come right into Keneal Bay. Cruz Bay is right here which is the main bay or the main town on St. John but uh, it's a little too congested and uh, ferries going in and out and not a lot of great anchorages over there so we're going to pull into Keneal Bay which I've stayed at before and it's a beautiful um, beautiful little cove and bay and you know the, they have a great um, resort called Keneal Bay there but um, so nice area so that's our trip today we anticipate probably pulling into St. John around 6 o'clock tonight so we'll see you on St. John protection for John today. Just a little bit extra. It's all of your shorts and everything. Here I am trying a different position, you know, doing your typical motorboat type of seating, facing forward, staying level, 
and we'll see how we do. We'll let you know in a little while. This is the before, and in about 20 minutes, we're going to have Mark spread out on the couch, rubbing his belly, going, oh. And I have all the faith today that Mark is not going to get seasick today. Mike doing his morning workout after he did just did an hour of yoga. <laughs> Michael, what do you have in your mouth? Big man chew, the thing of gum. Love gum. Can you show me how you like spit the gum? I don't spit gum. Please? No way. Just give me a little spit. I swallow it. You don't swwallow it. Like a real man. Tobacco juice. Please? Like tobacco juice. Today I decided to help against their uh, better judgment. They let me actually take the home. We don't have autopilot, we haven't figured out, and it's actually more fun just staying a course and actually using the steering wheel. Uh, so far I'm doing fine, 10 minutes out into the trip. Uh, one to two foot seas, couple of swells of three, uh, heading out, um, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So how, would you, how big do you say these are? See if you can twist it a little bit, Mikey. But don't lose them. Can you, can you bring it into the open? Uh, we just caught a nice uh, small tuna, uh, about four pounds. Uh, and John and Mike decided it'd be better if we let it go, go and that way it can grow up. And so we're going to try again. This is the forward cabin uh, where I sleep, and uh, I'm moving right along right now, probably seven and a half, eight knots, about 20 knots worth of wind, and this is what it looks like from uh, the front cabin. Be the day that I leave. This will be the day that I. Welcome to St. John. So here's our anchorage for the night. Uh, we're right outside of Keneal Bay, the resort, which is right in that cove there. So um, just outside, just went snorkeling. Beautiful, beautiful beach. Look at us! That is the yeah. ugliest fucking us! Today we had a lovely sale from, uh, what's it called? Uh, something Saint Amer? Thomas. No, what's it called? <laughs> something Amer. Yeah, they, they Charlotte Amer. Char Charlotte Amer. 
over to St. John's. Uh, nice wind. Best part of this entire thing is coming over here. Going swimming, snorkeling, saw a sea ray, went over to a little reef area, saw a whole bunch of fish, just got out of the water, took a nice shower on the back of the deck. This is what it's all about for me. This is as good as it gets. I love this. I could do it every day. Sail over here. We actually only did about four tacks, but when far out over by French Hat or French Rock, uh, then came right in between St. Thomas and St. John. Absolutely beautiful. Just went snorkeling with uh, John and Mike and did find a little reef. Uh, just just fantastic. Now we just all we have to figure out is uh, what's for dinner and uh, just uh, relaxing tonight. It's going to be a nice fun night. So here's our sunset tonight. We're on St. John, Canal Bay. Going to have some cheese and crackers and then we're going to head into town to grab some dinner and drinks. Just beautiful. Welcome aboard. Here is Mark's masterpiece. We're actually true cruises tonight. We decided not to go into town and eat or get off the boat. We decided just to, well Mark did, just to whip some stuff together and uh, fill us up and we'll stay on the boat without um, leaving tonight. Thanks Mark. There's one thing in my life that's missing. It's the time that I spend alone. Sailing on the cool and bright clear water.